All right. Here we go with lesson 4.2 guided practice. We're talking about rates of change. And let's start with the first question. Based on the information in the table, is the relationship between time and the number of words typed a proportional relationship? Well, let's see. We have, we're looking at the number of words divided by the number of minutes. And we have 45 divided by 1. That is equal to, let me get this, it's equal to 45 obviously. And then the next one, uh, we have 90 divided by 2, which we will put in as 90 divided by 2. 90 divided by 2 is still 45. And then the next one, 135 divided by 3. 135 divided by 3. That also is 45. And then we have this last one here, which would be 180 divided by 4. 180 divided by 4, and that is also 45. So, is it a proportional relationship? Well, the ratios are the same throughout. So, yes, it is is a proportional relationship. Uh, you know what I think I'll do? I think I'll do this. I'll do this and make it kind of gray, just to say, yeah, there it is. Or, you know what? Maybe not gray, blue. Got to do that. So, no, blue's bad. Sorry. How about green? That's probably best like that. Okay. Find the constant of proportionality, which is K. Then write the equation for the relationship between X and Y. Okay. The constant of proportionality. Let's bring this in tight. K. Uh, maybe I'll do it over here. And I'll write K is... Goodness gracious, k is equal to the y value divided by the x value. So the first one is 10 divided by 2. So that's 10 divided by 2. And I'll just write the equal. Uh, is that the same as 20 over 4? Shoo betcha. How about 30 over, oh, sorry. Yeah, 30 divided by 6. Yeah, it's the same thing. And is that equal to 40 divided by 8? All of them are equal to 5. So that k, or the constant of proportionality, is, oh goodness, it's 5. So, if we see, hopefully, that the y values, every y value, is 5 times any x value. Because, as we look at this, you would multiply by 5 in every case. Okay, next, you know, maybe what I'm looking at here is, uh, how about I cut to the chase? How about, uh, how about, am I doing the same thing to go from x to y? And this is divided by 4, this is divided by 4, that's divided by 4, that's divided by 4. So the y value, let me write a better y. The y value is any x value divided by 4. That's our equation. So, how can you represent a proportional relationship using an equation? This is what you do. You find, you find the constant of proportionality, which is k. Uh, an equation, an equation for the, the proportional relationship is y equals k times x. That's all you got to know for that. Guided practice. Hope it's been helpful. Thanks for watching.